Welcome back to the Tool Crib. Today we are going to be looking at a pretty new set of wire strippers on the market. These are the Klein Catapult. This is model number 11063W. And these are probably one of the best wire strippers I've ever used. So these are going to be an automatic wire stripper and cutter. So the way the cutter works, it has just two opposing knives. You'll stick your wire through there. And we'll just go ahead and do that on this one right now. This is uh, just standard uh, 12 gauge stranded. You can see you set your cutter or set your wire through there. Just give the handle a squeeze and it cuts it off incredibly cleanly. So it uses a knife cutting action uh, in order to uh, cut your wire. So this is obviously for copper only. Now, the way these automatic wire strippers work is much like you'll find with most automatic wire strippers is that they're going to have a locking bar that's going to come down against a uh, lower block. That lower block uh, in this one, it has some serrations in there or not serrations, but uh, some milling in there uh, and some knurling in order to be better grip onto uh, the insulation of the wire in order to hold it in place. And then this particular set, what makes this set nice is that this one, instead of using a tearing motion to get the insulation off, it actually has knives that will come down, collapse around the insulation, cut it, and then pull it apart. So it makes a, a lot cleaner cut than a lot of other automatic wire strippers. So this is gonna go from uh, 20 gauge to 10 gauge uh, uh, stranded wire and 18 gauge to eight gauge solid wire. Now, what I like about these is, is like I mentioned before, is they make a very, very precise cut. So here's an example. We're going to be using uh, 12 gauge stranded here. So I'm going to strip off uh, just about a quarter inch here. So all you got to do is just set it down. The jaws come down, lock it in place. The cutters drop, and then it does a perfect cut. So let's say that uh, you get... Uh, you realize that you didn't cut the insulation quite far enough. You need to add on, uh, you know, you need to strip it down another quarter of an inch. So you can very easily see how much you got left and how much more you need to add. Uh, hit it. And because of the, the way this system works, because it's using knives instead of uh, another vice, basically, to rip the insulation apart, it makes the cut first and then pulls the insulation apart. You can make very, very precise uh, steps, step cuts back on the insulation if you didn't get it quite enough. We're going to go even less than that now, about an eighth of an inch. And as soon as we set pressure on it, pull it apart, you can see that it makes, well, I say that, and then it, it missed the back side of that one. So let me try that one more time. There it did. Uh, but it made a very nice clean cut around that insulation. Same is true for all the gauges of wire. They're, they're just spaced perfectly. Set it, pull, and it strips right off. So this is a great benefit to these is that it first makes the cut with the knife before pulling the insulation. So it makes a lot cleaner cut than a lot of other automatic wire strippers. I was actually pretty impressed with the price on this one too. This one, I think I got this one for 28 if I'm not mistaken. Uh, they range from about 28 to 30 dollars and i'll leave links down below for these but uh cushion gripped handles as well they're very comfortable to use the only downside to these particular strippers is the fact that they don't collapse any further than what they are so putting these in your toolbox or in your truck or whatever or a bag they're a little a uh, little cumbersome because of their overall footprint. Now, you're always going to have a need for your standard wire strippers. Uh, that's another downside to these is you're not going to be able to get into the absolute tightest quarters with these. Uh, so sometimes you'll just need a regular set of wire strippers that uh, to, in order to perform those tasks. So, you know, your regular standard wire strippers are just not going away. But these catapults are really, really nice. And if you have repetitive work, uh, if you are an electrician, then these are probably, if I was an electrician, they would be in my bag. I'm not an electrician. They're already in my bag. So uh, if I were an electrician, though, these would be a must-have item for me. Again, these are the Klein catapult. Model number 11063Ws. I'll have links in the description below for these if you want to pick them up. They're actually very reasonably priced, and I highly, highly recommend them. My name is Ben. You've been watching the Texas Tool Career, but I appreciate you watching, and I'll see you in the next one.